Hey guys, it's Derek, Children's Pastor at Lakewood Christian Center, and I want to show you how to do the next great worker for God. Which, all you need to do is have these um, pieces of cardboard and the paper. And below this uh, video, there will be a link that you can click to find this uh, printout. It's gonna, it should be a picture, and uh, you just click on it, download it, print it out on the, on the paper, and then just cut it out on the lines that are provided for you. Um, this is a modified trick done by Julian Mather, the birthday party magician. And he's got a great, it's a great little presentation that he has that's the next greatest magician or the great, you know, something like that. And he's got different magicians all in these slots. And I just modified it to have a whole bunch of uh, great workers of God instead. And, uh, of course, Dodo's in there. And, um... Most of y'all might not know who that is, so, but you can keep it in there. It's not going to, you don't even have to say anything about them, but you can point to uh, anybody on here. And because uh, we got Dave Ramsey, Bob and Larry, Beth Moore, any other name on here is going to be somebody you know, but, you know, Dodo, of course, you can point to uh, our videos if anybody asks, well, who's that? But all you have to do is you talk about it, and when you say there's no room, you just put the two together like this. And this is how the printout actually comes with the dotted line where you cut out like that. So this is one normal size sheet of paper. You cut that out. And then when you want to uh, show the open space, all you're actually doing is moving this down a notch like so. This is all you're actually doing. So you're here and there's no space. You move here, and there's an open space. Now, if you did it like that for the actual presentation, if you said there's no room, and then you just move this down, it's pretty simple, and everybody's going to be able to see exactly how it's done. And that's okay, but if you want to add a little more mystery to it, you want to talk about adding, um, looking at it a different way, and that's how uh, Julian teaches it. He turns the thing, and he kind of hits this to kind of get a different view. And so now, because you're looking at it like this instead of this, you don't see a transition that's this to here. You're seeing this and then this, and the change can actually happen. And it looks like you're kind of doing the same thing, and all of a sudden there's an open spot inside the papers. And that's it. Enjoy, guys.